Hello and welcome to our first video tutorial for Paperless for Windows, the document storage solution by Mariner Software. Now in this tutorial, we'll learn about the system requirements, how to install Paperless, how to serialize it, and how to use your scanner with Paperless. Let's get started. Now Paperless for Windows requires that you run either Windows Vista or Windows 7. Next, the amount of hard disk space required to run Paperless depends on the type and the size of the documents you're storing in your libraries. The software takes up about 45 megabytes of hard disk space. To find out how much space you have, from the Start menu, select Computer, and then look at your local hard drive. As you can tell, I have plenty of space. Let's go to the Mariner Software site. Now we hope that you'll visit this site often and find out about the rest of the software that we offer, but for now, let's concentrate on Paperless. Click on the Download button. Next, scroll down to Paperless for Windows and click on the link. Now if you're new to Mariner Software, you'll be prompted to fill out this form. Enter your first name, your last name, your email address, click the box if you'd like to receive special advance notifications from us, and then click on the Submit button. The download box appears. Click on the OK button. Now once the software has been downloaded to your computer, locate the paperless file and click on the Extract All button. Now select the location for the file and click the Extract button. Once the software has been extracted, locate the paperless installer file and double click to start the installation. A security box will appear. Click the Run button. A security window will appear. Click the Yes button. Now once the setup has finished initializing, this window will appear. Click the Next button. Continue through the installation process by clicking the Next button. Review the license agreement, agree to the terms, and click the Next button. Click the Next button again. Select the type of setup you'd like to do, and click the Next button. And finally, click the Install button. Once the installation has completed, Click the Finish button. Now this registration window will appear. If you want to use Paperless in the demo mode, click the Not Yet button. If you have a serial number and you're ready to register your copy, click the Enter Serial button. Fill out your name, your organization name if applicable, your serial number just the way you received it from us including any dashes and capitalization, and then click the OK button. Installing Paperless from a CD is easy. Simply insert the CD into your drive label side up and then continue through the installation and serialization process. Now Paperless stores a variety of files such as document and graphics files in a library. When you get to the screen in the installation process, you'll be prompted to either create a new library or open an existing Paperless library. Let's create a new library, so click the New button. We're going to create an empty library so select the Create Empty Library option and then click on the OK button. Next, give your library a name, specify the path where you want it to be saved, and then click on the OK button. OK, let's talk about scanning with Paperless. First, make sure your scanner drivers are up to date from your operating system. Next, make sure that your scanner is plugged into your computer. Now from inside Paperless, from the Edit menu, choose Preferences. Now click on the Scanner tab. This is where you'll select your scanner and configure just a few preferences. If your scanner is a Twain compliant scanner, click on the Select Scanner button, select the scanner you'd like to use, and then click on the Select button. Now if you're using a Fujitsu ScanSnap scanner, you'll want to select the ScanSnap option. Below that are three checkboxes. The first one deals with the ScanSnap scanner software. If you want the Scan Manager software to be automatically launched when you press the Scan button, click the button. The other two options deal with confirmation messages that you receive after importing items either through your scanner or through dragging and dropping the files into the library. Now let's wind up the setup process by clicking on the Files tab. There are a series of options. Paperless creates a PDF file of anything that you scan into your library. The first section deals with reading and adding information to the PDF files. If you want to use an external viewer to view your PDF files, click the External Viewer checkbox. Now if you want Paperless to write searchable metadata to your PDF file, click the Write Metadata checkbox. 
Finally, select the PDF viewer you'd like to use as the default viewer to view your PDF files. The Files section deals with how Paperless handles your files. Select the options you wish to use and then close the window. Now we're ready to scan into Paperless. Let's take a look at the scanner related buttons on the toolbar. The Scan button scans each of your pages to separate PDF files. The Multi-Scan button scans multiple items and creates a single PDF file. Clicking either button brings up the Paperless Import window. If you'd like Paperless to autofill receipt fields or to perform optical character recognition on importing or scanning, click the checkboxes down at the bottom of the window. Now press the Scan button on your scanner and your scanner software will scan your documents. In the case of the ScanSnap scanners, when the last document has been scanned, click the Finish Scanning button. To the right is an area that you can enter some preliminary information such as the type of document, the name of the document, or the name of the merchant if you're importing a receipt, as well as other information. Once you're done entering the information, click the Done button. Okay, so that's it for our second tutorial. For more information, consult your user's guide. You can also email us via the website or check out our knowledge base under the support section. We're happy to help. For now though, make your office a paperless office.